An old school, oh, old school, quote unquote, uh, Smash 4 matchup here, Mario versus Fox. Anti been hanging on to Mario, still a very strong character, um, but falling out of uh, favor of the meta a little bit. So we'll see yeah, how he stacks I, up. Like, it's weird because I, I don't think Mario is a bad character. I think he's no. just underdeveloped in the meta right now. Mm -hmm. I feel like both these characters are kind of like, you know, they're still kind of waiting for their, their one. You know, obviously, Mario having great representation, Fox still having very good representation as well, and we'll see how this works out right here. Now, let me hit you with this, though. In a lot of matchups, and I think what seals the deal for both of these characters that prevents them from being higher, is that there's a lot of disjoints and a lot of really strong like mid-range options currently in the meta and in the top tier. But both of these characters having shorter limbs, both of them being combo heavy, and both of them having a decent amount of frame traps actually makes this really exciting in the fact that they have to deal with each other's options. So it's very risky for them to go in, but they both need to go in to get their damage. But there we go, great anti-air with the up smash right there from light, so off. To a very quick start. And so the anti anti air. <laughs> there, you know what? You got me. I cannot dispute fact. <laughs> All right. Gets oh! Say, oh my God! He two framed it. Yo, that was with the sweet spot too. That was a great uh, answer back uh, from anti right there. Especially because you know of the type of player that Light is. Like he's Light. He's, he's, yeah, his character is very. Yeah, light. He, he is. He is a hamster <laughs> on a wheel that just will not stop going. Yes. Like absolutely. he is constantly you know, pushing his advantage, and the lead can really snowball away from you very quickly if you're not careful. Yep, good reflector on that one, by the way. Mario, when he's following in the fireball like that, works a lot like a traditional slow fireball in 2D fighting games. Gets a lot of setups and a lot of block strings out of that, chasing him off stage, nothing off in the fair. Yo, he baits out the reflector, good job. Yeah, that was really smart for Manti. That's actually what, uh, ooh, there we go, the kill again. Give him the head, show him the hat. Yeehaw, yeehaw. <laughs> Oh yeah! <laughs> so, let's see what, so let's see what the answer is uh, from Light. Because this is kind of the problem for Fox that, you know, in, in the past where Fox could be a lot more, uh, I'd say a little bit more freeform with how he can get his kills. He's a little bit more linear in regards to, you know, how he goes about getting them. Yep, you just actually saw two kill setups right there. He went for the back air raw and he went for a falling there to try to combo an, uh, an up smash. Those are like the two real big deals that you see. But keeping him off stage right now is not a bad option either, especially when you're at a high percent and you'll die off the side in there. Yeah, anti uh, without his resources, so that was pretty much a, a textbook edge guard from Light. But once again, forced back into the corner. Ooh. Okay, super nice. You knew it was coming. Or he reacted to it. That was really good. Good yeah. chase on the roll. Oh, following? Oh, no. Oh, he went for three. He's playing Smash 4. <laughs> That's such a hard, like, muscle memory thing to tour to break. So Absolutely. definitely can't blame him on that one. So but still, for those, big lead right now. for those who do not know, they changed uh, jab locks from Smash 4 to uh, Ultimate. In Smash 4, you could lock three times, and your opponent was just locked in place. Now when you lock, you can lock up to two times or to two hits. And then your opponent gets to tech out, so you have to hit them before they can start teching. So he hit him three times, he was like, oh yeah, that's right, Fox vs. Mario, I'm playing Smash 4 right now, let me get this F Smash. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Yo, he's playing, he's playing Smash 4 too, he's going for runoff fair. Oh, but you see Light, again, just trying to, to pull the wool under Anti's eyes uh, off stage, but Anti just smartly holding on to his resources, not letting himself get caught. See, the thing is, I can't blame him for wanting to try to get Mario with this sort of percent here. A straight hit, a straight back air will probably do it at this point, maybe even for mid-stage. There you go, Dash Attack is at least gonna buy him some time here. Oh, yo! Oh! Yo! Just squeaking into the first row of seats Holy with that cow! I thought for sure he was gonna live that. There we go, good stuff. I was like, no, he's still in it, absolutely. <laughs> You're making me dizzy, Paris. What are you doing? <laughs> so good stuff there from Light. Again, kind of, he had to play that a majority of that last stock on the back foot, and for him to, you know, just keep the pressure on, keep anti, you know, honest. He was doing a really good job just uh, hanging around Mario when he was in disadvantage, and all that getting that kill. Um, and anti was trying to go for a down smash on landing, or yes. on Light's landing, and just coming up short for it. So now, see, the thing is, is that. Um, I always like to bring this up because I think it's very easy to forget. Uh, when you're playing at a top level like this, or playing at all, mind you, um, mental game, mental energy, mental fortitude comes into this a lot. Mm -hmm. Having a win, some would say stolen. I wouldn't say stolen because that was a very honest way to take the stock. Yep. Um, having a win swept out from under you when you've got a high lead like that is something you need to concentrate on, center yourself, bring yourself back to the game. And you see Anti looking off, taking a breather for a second, bringing himself back, not letting it get to him, which is the sign of like strong mental fortitude, which is what you need for this game, especially for a fast-paced matchup like this, going into game two. Yeah, so we're going to see a different uh, 
platform layout here. This stage uh, worked out very well for Anti in a setting against Nick C. Mm -hmm. um, being able to utilize these uh, high platforms of Town and City just to extend Mario's already very, very strong vertical game. <laughs> yep. But on, no. his, on the same foot, though? Fox can kind of do a lot of the same stuff. Now, now here's the thing that's uh, one of the things that I think is very important about this stage. Um, uh, inversely to Smash 4, the top of the stage is the highest for this stage, and the sides are actually super short now. Yes. So this actually does benefit Mario, I think, in terms of just that more than it does Fox, because Fox, you're you're gonna see like 70% of Fox stocks go to up Smash. Yes. Um, and higher ceiling, ooh, that was risky. Oh Doesn't actually get punished for it. Um, having that higher ceiling means he's not gonna die to that uh, up smash as much. Meanwhile, Mario has a lot of options to kill Fox off the side or even just give him off the side, but does it matter? Does it matter when you still die off the uh, top at like ooh. 110? And a taunt. All right, so light. Definitely flex on that first stock a little bit. Let's see uh, what the retaliation is from Anti. Gonna get his grab in. Getting him off stage, chasing him. Not bad. Okay, so he had to burn all his resources there. Jump, side, B, air dodge, everything. All right. Well, yes, very nice. The classic. Actually, <laughs> yes, the classic. So that's actually uh, kind of strange to do in this game. Oftentimes, if you do a move on someone incoming, but you don't actually hit them on their active frames when they're getting up, uh, you'll move past them. But he slid past. He was like, I'm going to be right at the edge of this. I'm waiting for that back throw. Yeah, very nice stuff uh, there for Manti. But still light. Continue to add on to the lead right now. Ooh, that looked like it was going to be a chase for the up smash. I'm waiting for it because this is close to the percent. Yeah, got the hit, not the the nair right there, but just not in range, or didn't get the hitbox he needed to set up into the up smash. So now Anti is gonna have to sit back and camp with back airs and fireballs. He's finally yep. able to get his hands on Fox. Ooh, and for good damage at that, goes into a tech chase as well. That's another thing. This platform does allow, or this platform layout. A lot of the platform layouts in town do allow for a lot of tech chases with how often they're out. Ooh, Ooh. wow. Early usage of it and gets back scot free, and then you know doesn't get back scot free. But yeah, Anti's been doing a really good job just knowing when to utilize that up B as early as possible to get back. Um, but right there, unfortunately, he's gonna lose the stock for it. Yep. So you actually saw right there, uh, Light tried to go for what looked like a jab block, but actually got a restand out of it because the down tilt hit him at too high of a percent. So that'll happen with a lot of moves in this game. Jab blocks typically they've coded it now to where jabs will pretty much always jab block, yeah, but other right. moves it's gotta be weak enough. All right, chasing him off. Very good use of the early up B. Oh, he just wow. does it. Yo, and you see he was doing the dash attack too. So he had that DI straight up. He wasn't DIing out. Hold on, actually, we can see that because of a little blue blur, right? Every time you get hit, yes, that shows what direction you're going to fly. Um, so you see it right there when he uppies? If you look, oh no, he actually did have the DI going on. He had the DI going on and he still got knocked off the top. <laughs> oh, looks, like, looks like we got timer side bets. <laughs> yeah, but really good stuff there from Light. Doing very well in a matchup that he's expressed uh, great displeasure in. Um, he's, you know, he's made it very uh, obvious he's not a big fan of fighting Mario's. I know Dark Wizzy's a, a bracket demon of sense for him right now, which is hmm. sort of the opposite of what happened in Smash 4. Light just kind of ran house on players that weren't Mars and such in the, in the New England area, but we'll see here. Uh, up two games to nothing on Anti, looking to punch his ticket in the top 16 winner side. Yep, and we're going to see if uh, Anti can get a number on the board here. He's still looking pretty strong, all things considered. Fox has got that strong kill option and up smash. Very good, even just to throw out, honestly, if you're not ready to whip punish or if you're just across the stage, then you're probably not going to get the punish on it. Good up, be out of shield. There you go. Cappy, um, Cappy making an appearance. Yeah, Cappy, absolutely. <laughs> he said, look, man, I got to make this 3-0 return run back. I need to go on an odyssey here. Let me get Cappy, <laughs> Cappy out here. Can I get Cappy side bets from the crowd? That'd be, that'd be something. All right. Up throw goes for the chase. He wants to kill him off the top. Anti trying to shark underneath these platforms, but providing good coverage for Light to get down. And just one thing Anti's been doing a really good job of so far, or something he's just good at naturally, his ability to frame trap you. Oh, there just you go, go for it again. So, look, I've been saying this over and over, but that is the smash forward. That is the up smash to up smash <laughs> true combo. Not even a combo, true block straight. If at first you do not succeed, roll back and try it again. Mm -hmm. That which doesn't. Ooh. I was going <laughs> to say, that which doesn't kill you make you stronger, but is that really true when you're down a stock and now back on even footing with life? Cut it to Kelly Clarkson, but otherwise. <laughs> All right. 
filling each other out. See, now, when I saw this pick, I thought, okay, this is probably for the platforms, for some Mario combos, and to see some fireball spacing out so we can try to get some uh, setups in neutral, try to bait out reflectors, etc. But we haven't seen a lot of fireballs, and we haven't seen a lot of Mario combos. We've been seeing Light take advantage of the platforms as well, sharking anti every time he's trying to land. Just one oh, oh, my goodness, the F-Smash angle downwards. Light get him out of here. Fox said fire. Mario said, sure thing, boss. <laughs> Boom. Hold my beer. <laughs> <laughs> right, but there was an interesting exchange I saw earlier where uh, Anti tried to do the jumping fireball, and Light was actually able to down air through it. So maybe look to see if that becomes a factor when Anti tries to go for that. Uh, yes. Ooh, that like wait out. Very patient on that one. A little bit of a, I don't know if I want to call it a desperation move, but that was a little aggressive there from Light trying to look out. Well, that was not so aggressive. No, not at all. Remember, if it works, it's not stupid. Never. <laughs> all right. Calculated. Calculated. Every time. So good job baiting out there. Actually landed about the same time off the nair, but he chooses to shield. Unfortunately, goes for the jab and doesn't hold the shield button. All right. Do you see the laser? Yep. That's like more flash than anything, I think, yeah. most characters. Oh, actually gets away from that without getting punished. Even chased the roll, but no such punish from light on anti Mario. Oh, good pivot grab. Okay, this could be the start of something big right here. Yeah, Anti's been doing a really good job keeping light in check at the ledge, uh, but light... Able to escape further harm that way. Has his work cut out for him right now. He, he went for his own Ghetto Fox confirm right there. He's <laughs> like, oh, man, I got Naren to down smash. Let me do that. Yeah, that Fox is definitely from Washington Heights. Sharking him out. Ooh, yeah, yeah. He wants it. He really wants Everybody it. Everybody in the room knows what oh, Anti's yeah. looking for. Right <laughs> like, I, don't think, I don't think it's much of a, a secret. He's trying to think with his head. There we go. All right. Oh, actually still gets hit by the very end of the down air on that one. So that thing is active and does have that one pop-up hit at the very end, which he traded with. Okay, gets the grab on the down air right there. No punish on the air dodge back into the ground. Yep, a little nervous here, sitting at a high percent. You don't want to get anything too crazy. Is he dead? He's... He oh, is. my God. Three? Oh. And there we go. The rogue up tilt on the platform. Is what I would say if that was a bad joke. But regardless, <laughs> great stuff there Yo, from no, Light. I did not, I did not catch that until I thought about it. I had to put two and two. See now with the heat, with the time of day. I